coming right behind me here. I am coming right behind you. Okay. Look at that butt. Look at that butt. I work out. I work out. Here's your key. This time maybe if we're gonna lock it, we should probably lock it and oh, take lock the key it out. Take the key out of the door. <laughs> yes. That was very funny last night. Okay. Yeah. Oh, the boat's waiting. I see that. <laughs> Literally a dolphin right off the side of the boat here. We're talking quiet because it's early in the brain. Dolphins following us. Maybe it's like Flipper. Maybe he'll like come right up to the edge of the dock. Maybe he'll swim away. <laughs> Uh, sidetracked by dolphins but the master and commander's on a mission and we're at a people boat so we can talk now and we can we, talk really loud and we've got 7,000 hours of dolphin footage <laughs> you can never have enough dolphin footage <laughs> yeah. right right yeah. you can never have enough dolphin footage <laughs> I might beg you to We are on the hunt to find three things today. Cheap beer. Oh, we already found that. Oh. Um, I didn't know we were on any kind of a hunt. We want to get up close and personal with the sloth. <laughs> Dude, we... <laughs> we want to find a red frog and... Um, anteaters. And an anteater, which I think the third one's going to be tough, but... Well, you need to find a pile of ants. Like seven o'clock in the morning. It's really nice right now. Um, it's probably like 25 degrees. <laughs> yeah, probably is 25 degrees. It's probably 25 degrees. It's a nip. It's gonna be very talkative this morning. Um, so it's a perfect time to go for a stroll because it's not too hot yet. Has it? All the red frogs go to the spa. So we're gonna go check it out. Okay, now. now we're off to find a sloth. That's a good thing about getting a picture of a sloth. What? Is they don't move very fast. Yeah. So they won't be able to escape. Uh, okay. It's not like oh. getting a picture of like a jaguar or you know cheetah or a dolphin. Or a dolphin or a whale, you know? Because they'll just sit there and look at it. Number one, but you probably can't see him in this video. But he's right there. Head down to the beach. Um, I was thinking we go to the beach club maybe. Go that way and then around? That or way? go up and around? I think go up and around. Make that loop. Okay. Make that loop. Okay, no sign. But that goes to the beach, doesn't it? Yeah. I think that goes to the beach. I think that goes to like Turtle Beach. Okay. So we're going to go this way. We took a wrong turn, so we're going to try this one more time. And we're going to go this way.
throughout the entire island there are these villas and they're all different sizes but they come with um, a golf cart uh, and on top of that they all have um, a little private pool. This one's really nice because it's like right off the beach. caught in a torrential downpour no we don't need we don't need wet gear or an umbrella because it just sprinkles here it doesn't pour rain no it always pours rain you <laughs> probably the most hard-headed person in the world <laughs> i'm an optimist it's an optimist yeah <clears throat> and i'm a realist <laughs> but it's really raining oh my god so note to self when kevin says it's raining and it's going to rain, you should listen to it. Well, it looks like the rain has stopped and the sun is coming out. So I think it's time for us to go out and explore, start checking out some of the anchorages in the Panama Cruising Guide. If you've liked this episode, 
please click on subscribe below. And thanks for watching. Ciao for now.